Right, Join us now from Chicago is lifestyle expert Karina Heinrich. Good morning. I love that you're all set Good up. Good morning. Good morning. Great to see you. We have so much fun with you. Uh, let's talk about some of these gift ideas because you've got some great ideas. Even in the colder, snowier weather, kids can get out there and explore nature, yes. right? Absolutely. So it's really great this year, if you're like me with my three kids, to give your children gifts that will actually excite them to get outside regardless of that weather explore nature even if your kids aren't outdoorsy the ideas i'm going to share today are gifts that will motivate them to get off those devices and <laughs> off the couch yes so the yeah the first one that's so easy is giving your kids things like binoculars a field microscope a compass those are all super cool that way you can set up this holiday scavenger hunt let them search for items on their list and once they find them, they can be little scientists and really learn about each find. This is an amazing activity for the whole family. Even if it's in your own backyard, you have a competitive family like the Heinrichs. You can set up into teams and you can see who can find the most on their list. Exactly. So these are all really fun. Now, I'm not into insects, but somehow that always becomes the focus with my three kids. <laughs> Too much fun. You have but some binoculars there, right? Is that what you got? Yes. There? This is binoculars, a compass, and this is so they can like look at all those bugs that they want to scare mommy with. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. And I love that you turn it into a family idea as well, and you can all exactly. just be creative about it. Uh, what about when it gets kind of nasty out there? And what can you do to bring them in? Inside as well. You've got a whole table there. I've got, I want to see them all. I, I have a whole setup. So, what my kids love doing is they love documenting all of these finds. So, these are kids' cameras that you can get. You can take pictures. We love spotting birds, and I had known mm -hmm. nothing about birds. So, you can do fun things like playing something like bird bingo, and then you can really find these with any category bugs, trees, flowers, even dogs out there. So play bird bingo, learn about them, and then go outside and actually document them. This is a Polaroid one, so kids can actually print it out right away so cool. and keep it for them. Yeah. So cool. I love, And the Polaroid's always fun because I think people forget and our pictures get lost in the camera and you can actually get a physical picture exactly. there. Exactly. What exactly. about the butterfly farm you have there? Exactly. This is really fun because kids can kind of really stick with this. We're going to grow our own butterflies from start to finish, cool. show kids the process. And then it's so hands on. My kids also love crafts. So again, if the weather isn't conducive of being outside, you can set up a painting station by a window. And you know what? These are amazing gifts you can give to grandma and grandpa that I know they would never turn down no matter what their grandchild makes. <laughs> and then of course, stargazing. Even if you can't go outside, get near a window and you can check out all the stars. This is really special. We live in this city. We can't see all the stars. But if you're going on a road trip this holiday season, this is so easy to pack along with you. So obviously the goal is to get them outside, let them be creative. This is the gift that keeps on giving. Nourish mm -hmm. your child's inner scholar and scientist and let them kind of have at it. Karina, I love all of the ideas you brought. You always bring such great energy. We appreciate your time. <laughs> Lifestyle expert, Karina Heinrich. We'll check in with you Thank again, you I'm sure, because you've got some great ideas for all of the little budding scientists. Happy holidays. Thank you. Happy holidays.